Hi guys, welcome back for another video. We have uh, new parts arrived guys for the 18 uh, Subaru WRX. And I'm gonna show you guys right now what we have. So here we go. We have uh, two each tires. So the tires that we have for the 18 WRX is Falcon brand. So this uh, item that we ordered is Falcon Azenis. So it will go with two decals on each tires. And I kind of like the way they came out. So let's do this. Uh, before we start this items, we're going to need, uh, of course, a bucket, water, um, acetone. Before you applied everything, you, you must clean the tires really well. Just to let you know, guys. Of course, the gloves and I'm using this brush to start with the soap and water. And after that, um, after everything is dried, we're going to apply the acetone. Um, uh, so now uh, we have the car lifted only uh, on the back side. So we're going to start the back first. Um, for me, it's not as smart to do this while the car is on the floor or in the ground because um, you're applying pressure on the tire and to push the decal uh, out while you try to stick it in the tires. So I really suggest um, lift the part where you want to put the decal first, then work your way out from there. Um, so what I did is I lift the back part. So both tires right now are lifted. I'm gonna start on both sides. And also um, some other people I saw that uh, they're cleaning the whole tires. So I'm, I'm planning to save time. So I'm just gonna clean uh, if you see right here guys the tires I'm only planning to clean um, certain part that the decal will go so I'm not gonna clean the whole tire I'm just gonna clean some some of it and I will measure the decal how far it can go and um, put a measuring tape to the end of the decal so that's the part that we can go and uh, clean it with the soap and brush and the acetone and apply the decal so it will save time and probably sand it we'll see i'll show in the video if i need to sand it or not but it seems like i need to As you see, we put uh, the marker right here. So I'm only cleaning from inside through here. Not hold the tire, no.
So we're applying the acetone right now. Uh, be careful with this not to uh, not to put it in your rims. So I have a matte black rim, so I'm trying to be careful, like not to try to hit my rim. I'm not sure what's gonna be the effect on that, but it's just too strong. The smell is too strong. I'm not wearing a mask right now, but I, I suggest you guys do. So I see that the part of the tire right now is so clean after I apply the soap and dried it. And now I'm applying the acetone. And also you need to, um, you need to sand it. The, the seller is, you know, really good at send, sending me some sandpaper. In a minute, we're gonna apply um, acetone behind the uh, decal also before we apply the glue that they included. So what we're doing now is we're applying acetone behind the decal. Uh, it's a must to clean and make sure no dust or anything on your decal before you apply it. So just make sure you apply the acetone behind the decal also. And after everything is dry and everything, you can apply the glue and we can start Put it in the decal into your tire. So everything is clean and I'm gonna wipe the tire one more time with uh, some acetone just to make sure. It says under instruction you can do this at least 10 times you know, maybe they just want to make sure no dust or any grease, anything at all. Because, you know, we always clean our tires with that tire shining um, lotion. Or, so we have to make sure everything is clean. I'm about to apply the decal any minute. Yeah. Right now we're applying the glue behind uh, the decal. Make sure the edges, the mid, the middle part of the decal, you focus on putting a glue on. And this is a time consuming, just to let you know. just barely putting the first decal and we have to do the second decal on the same tire the edges are more, the most important ones so make sure you guys put the glue by the edges and the middle part. So um, we have applied the uh, decal already. So it says under instruction we have to wait at least 10 minutes before we remove the cover on the top. 10 minutes and we have to apply pressure on each uh, letters. So everything will stick really well. I hope I did good. Cross finger. And um, it does require not to drive the car at least more than an hour or no washing after that. But um, I'm planning to rest it at least 10 hours because I'm off today. 
and I will finish every uh, uh, four tires. I'm not gonna drive this car until not tomorrow when I go to work. For now, we're just gonna rest this for 10 minutes and then we're gonna remove the cover, the white liner on the top of the letter. So we just finished um, installing the first one. Um, it looks really great, actually, guys. I'm really happy. It looks really great. Um, I kind of like the way it came out. Um, there's only a few mistakes that I did. You know, of course, there's always a mistake on first time doing everything, right? Um, just be careful and try to avoid putting so much uh, glue um, behind the decal before you applied it. Um, I kind of put so much that, uh, even on the film in the, like on the top of the decal, I put it so you can see here, I'll show you guys quick. You guys can see here that, uh, I over put so much that I have this white thing that goes in like above the letter. That's my mistake. And you can see it through here. This one right here and right there. Well, like I said, it's not perfect, but it looks really great. So I really like the way it came out. I'm just, I'm just gonna keep uh, doing the rest. So I'll show you guys when everything is done. Hi, uh, just to follow up with the video, everything is done. As you see, everything is installed. The Falcon Azenis uh, decals for the tires for the 2018 WRX is already installed. Um, guys, if you have any question, um, let me know. Comments below and I will help you guys as much as I can. They look great and I really like the way they came out. Let me show you guys the other one right there. And let's go around the car. It's time consuming, that's all I can say. It's time consuming. Uh, that's the other side. Overall, they look great. I think that's it for this video, guys. If you have any questions, uh, let me know. Comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.